Hi, I'm Chef Stu Pat Rocky, and this is Quick Meals with me, Stu Pat Rocky. Dad's on his way. What are we gonna do? You'll be all right because here comes Stu. It's Quick Meals. The first thing you might notice is that the opening credits are a bit different. My director slash editor slash girlfriend is not here. She's decided to spend some time with her mother and think things over. Her mother lives in a beautiful American craftsman home located in the central San Joaquin Valley. And anyways, uh, she took her computer with her and all of the Quick Meals files, but I still have my alphabet magnets and the backwards hat chef has decided to help out with the music. This episode is all about winning back the one you love. I don't know what I did wrong, but I want to make it better. You're all I have in this world and I want you back in my arms. And that's why today's Quick Meals recipe is her favorite meal, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Peanut butter and... Grape. Jelly. Sandwich. Sure, this is a simple meal, but simple food done right is what this show's all about. Here's what you're gonna need. Here are your ingredients. Peanut butter. Butter. No, that's not a remix. Butter, like from a cow. Grape jam, her favorite. I prefer strawberry, but, but now is probably not the time for that argument. And two slices of bread that we're gonna toast. A love for food is something we both share. The meals we've had have so many good memories. Our first date was at an In-N-Out Burger. I uh, wanted to go animal style that night, but it took a few more dates before it felt right. Taste buds, I haven't mentioned this on the show before, but my dad left when I was young. My mom served him burnt macaroni and cheese for dinner and he left in a rage. I haven't seen him since. For a stew pap rocky PB&J, we're gonna start by toasting our bread. It's not that I'm afraid of being alone. I'm not one of those people. I've been alone most of my life. It's that I can't stand the idea of losing someone that I love. Happened once with my dad, but never again. I'm not gonna lose you, babe. So I've toasted the bread just the way she likes it. She likes it to look like Matthew McConaughey's skin in Failure to Launch. That's her favorite romantic comedy. Let's butter our slices. Myself, I don't like Failure to Launch. I kind of wish Sarah Jessica Parker would just disappear. And, and I say that as a stalwart fan of the movie Striking Distance. Now to prep our peanut butter and jelly. Grab a cup, a mug, or whatever. Dump a spoonful of each in. One to one ratio, taste buds. A day without laughter is a day wasted. I agree. Take a knife and mix them up real good. This is heck to clean up and obviously it all gets mixed up anyway, but that's the way she likes it. And I love that that's the way she likes it. Then we're going to spread our PB and J mix all over our slices. Make sure to slather your PB and J right to the corners. We want each and every bite to be consistent. There's another quick and delicious meal, sure, to make your taste buds pap, but we're not done yet. Babe, I know you're in the central San Joaquin Valley doing some thinking, but I hope this heart-shaped recipe makes your heart string zing. Please come back. I don't know what I did, but I promise we can fix it. And taste buds, check back next week Hopefully the love of my life will be back and the episode will look a little more professional. On a serious note, to any of my taste buds living in neighborhoods on the west side of Los Angeles, please be careful. There have been several mountain lions spotted prowling the area in the last week. Apparently they wandered down from the Santa Monica mountains. I hope your bellies are happy now. Stu is happy to be here for you. 
If you want to contact Stu, which you do, he prefers Twitter. Yes, he does. At Stu Pap Rocky.